Yeah. Hi, Kellyanne. Day 39, and have I got some shocking news. I cannot believe this myself, and I would love to have comments and response to this uh, next little section. I had to do taxes this week and actually gained weight one day. I'm just now back to 145. Juiced exactly the same, drank exactly the same, exercised and worked. May have worked too much and then stressed out. I just can't believe that the work is doing this to me. So I gotta start taking my own advice. Rest when you feel the need. Don't just push through. So my goal is to learn to meditate more, is to learn to stay calm and to take some breathing and just to remember that, you know what? Life is here for me to enjoy not to accomplish anything in particular, just to really enjoy. So anybody out there has the information how I could stay calmer, and not stress out over work and taxes, please feel free to contact me. Okay, a lot of people have been asking me, what about pictures? You're only showing your big head on here. All right, here's the deal. I've done some different transitioning throughout the past five years. So at the end of my 90 day feast, I'm going to post before any weight loss, my top weight, I'm gonna post photos of before raw and after going raw, and then before the juice feast and after the juice feast, all in a nice series. And I'm gonna state the changes that I made over the past few, five years. And then everyone can see the changes and what's led me to the juice feast and how it's um, taken over my body and help me feel great and everyone will be able to see it at the end. Some of the comments I received from friends and family are, what are you weight obsessed? What do you, how skinny do you want to be? You know, I'm still not even in the normal weight category. I'm still in the overweight category, but I'm going to address those comments now. Um, the thing of it is, is this juice feast is for organ cleansing. Yes, you lose weight with it and that is an easy way to gauge what's going on with my body. So I talk about it, but the fact is I'm doing this to cleanse my body, to let my gut rest, to let my organs detox, to take away all the work of the digestion constantly, and just to let everything, let Mother Nature take its course, make me a leaner, healthier person, to live a longer, more vitality-filled life. So, but with that, I also wanna say stress has changed my view on things because during the maximum part of my stress i could feel little twinges in my gut and i was very surprised at how it affected me and how it caused me to retain fluids so if anybody has any information bring it on i want to really give thanks to all those people who've been so supportive and so kind and so inspiring with their comments and their uh, messages for me. It has meant so much to me and helped me get through some of the trying times and just help me stay positive and motivated. And again, I just wanna say thank you, thank you, thank you.